hello friends and welcome to my channel if you are brand new don't forget to hit that subscribe button because i share with you guys a ton of very motivating very inspirational and great content for you and the whole family from motherhood homemaking lifestyle and wellness hauls product reviews and unboxing so i hope that you guys stick around and today it's our monthly grocery haul which it's actually hosted by my friend tiffany and myself we've been doing this for pretty much the whole year and we do it once a month and we share with a few other youtubers that are going to be also sharing with you their grocery haul and it can be so many different groceries uh stores so if you want to find out what Walmart has, what Trader Joe's has, what Target has, what Costco has, stay tuned because there's going to be a lot of great, great uh, reviews and hauls for you guys on the description box on the playlist. And be sure to check my friend Tiffany at Small Town 6. Dear friend, I send you a hug and let's go ahead and begin with this haul today. what we have today so to begin let's start from this end these are new to us uh, we usually get the nature bakery the fake bars but they have these ones that are strawberry and apple and also have oatmeal crumble so I thought they would taste delicious and probably the kids will love that so I wanted to give that a try and clinics uh, because you need tissues in your life and then also some, uh, this is our favorite bacon from Costco. The price fluctuates so much. It was at 18 something. So it's a little bit right now um, on the higher price uh, at this time. But it's always like goes up and down. So yeah, um, but it's delicious. You guys, I highly recommend this brand from Pure Farms. Then we have some portobello mushrooms. Um, I love to make these uh, in the oven filled with um, some cheese and tomato sauce and, you know, make it like little pizzas on portobello. They taste so good and I love the sizes. They were like not too big, not too small. Perfect size for a gathering, which I think we're going to be having that soon and these i'm addicted to them i confess they are so delicious they're from tropical fields uh and they are organic crisp, crispy coconut rolls they give you that tiny bit of sweetness and crunchiness that it's really fulfilling so if you have a costco or if you want to check i think even amazon might have these brand Tro tropical fields coconut rolls check them out um and peanut butter pretzels my kids and my husband love those things um then we also have strawberries here the kids love strawberries we have some organic eggs these are the typical you probably have seen them before in my hauls but this is the typical costco um eggs that we like to use and then i got these dynamos from uh, costco i usually get the smaller case um, but they were on sale at Costco and I decided to give them a try since the kids have been really enjoying them and they have a strawberry banana and strawberry flavor. Then we move on to Real Good Foods Company. Um, they have the pre-made um, bacon wrap stuff jalapenos. I have done this, um, you know, on my own. Uh, from scratch before but you know they have a lot a box already loaded with 18 in them great for gatherings we're great for an easy fast appetizer now we have some spring mix uh, organic so hopefully we'll get to finish this before it goes bad if you know what I mean and then we have this veggie made great a lot of you are probably familiar with these muffins um, they're really, really good. Actually, they're keto friendly. Uh, they look a little bit different from what I've seen in the past. Sometimes you have like the salty uh, um, ones that are like egg and uh, veggies, but this one is a muffin that actually has zucchini and carrots, but it's a cinnamon roll muffin, which I think the kids will absolutely love. 
and I will also love them because they'll be eating some zucchini and carrots in there. Moving on, we have some keto bread. This is my favorite bread, you guys. I have to say that even though it's keto, it's fully, fully white and it tastes, the texture and everything is so delicious. I love these bread so much. So with that being said, we move on to blue diamond almonds and usually I'm not an almond person, but I was sold. I've never tried, tried these particular ones before, but they have chili lime and I could not resist you guys chill line so a good snack a good thing to have on the go uh, and then uh, and then we have this 4505 chicharrones fried pork rings and obviously I mean once I see this logo in anything even if it's in my husband I will definitely pick this in a hurry because tajin I mean tajin is life you guys and if you don't know tajin you don't know life <laughs> just kidding but yeah um, these are really good uh, I mean so good you guys I can't wait to try them um, then we have these cocktail cucumbers great for little dips or you know just with lime and chili lime or tahine again we go back to that and uh, you know great snack to have for the kids as well then we have this two pack. Uh, this is actually my preferred ham just because I can cut one, freeze one, and um, I have plenty of ham uh, on this case. And I love the layers that they're perfectly cut and uh, the best thickness that you can have on the ham. So it's 98% fat free, no artificial preservatives, and no artificial um, color. So I, I really like the taste of this. I really like that it doesn't have no nitrates uh, and you know any additional stuff that it might be harmful for our health and these are great for gatherings as well uh, they're uh, prosciutto uh, suppressata and more prosciutto just different kind and rolling to um, cheese these are our go-to especially for gatherings they're a great little uh, things for charcuterie boards and we have some raspberries uh, they were looking so good to me and I hope that the kids feel like eating them because sometimes it's a hit and miss with them sometimes they'll eat them all sometimes they don't eat them so we'll see now this is new I haven't seen these before you guys this is from no Nuka Noka it's organic superfood smoothies they have probiotics fiber and plant protein with flax it's a strawberry pineapple mix and um i really hope that the kids will eat this because again i'm all about hiding nutrition into whatever the kids uh treats they like and i hope this is like a treat for them uh, but knowing that it has a great nutrition in them so this is the first time I'm giving them a try and see how they go for them. Then we have this spinach artichoke parmesan dip. Uh, this is really good. I mean, I've had these before. This is great for gatherings. You warm it up with pita chips, anything. It just goes with everything. And these, you guys, I had them last time. I, we got them last time uh, from from uh, Costco and they still had them and I was like yes I'm I'm getting one of these uh, they're candy hearts they're like they taste like candy hearts you guys they're really really tasty they're really crunchy perfect um, for gatherings and the kids love them so that's a plus and then I saw the White Claw on sale watermelon is my favorite uh, mango is actually pretty good so Number one, second, and third place as far as my favorites. Um, I have been keeping on check my alcohol intake and I've been actually doing pretty good trying to stay and stick with, you know, family events and maybe on the weekend, but that's about it. Um, learn more about my positive monthly challenge. Uh, you know, I talked about this by the time this comes this video comes I probably already talked about this so positive monthly challenge is all about wellness and health and 
something to bring goodness into your life. So be sure to check out that video. And that is a wrap. All right, you guys, now that we unpack Whole Foods, we're gonna go ahead and get started and show you and share with you what we got. I got some bananas, I got uh, bananas for the week. Um, I got some Wild Wonders, um, different cherry uh, tomatoes and for salads and I just like them anywhere. I really, really like tomatoes. And then I got these, um, I haven't tried these, the Whole Foods brand. I usually get the Siete, um, but they were a lot, li a lot cheaper. Um, I think they're smaller and, uh, but I thought that I will still give them a try because they were a lot cheaper than the um, Siete brand. I also got some pita chips, uh, sea salt flavor from the Whole Foods brand. Uh, actually, Whole Foods prices uh, for the their own brand is very reasonable, I think. Uh, and then I got some uh, Chobani Greek yogurt non-fat, just plain because I, I wanna try a new recipe that um, makes um, bagels. So I got some uh, Bob's Red Meal Artisan Bread Flour, and uh, we're gonna go ahead and give that a try. And then um, I also got some uh, organic Caesar croutons, and these are for salad uh, kick that I'm being craving. So I got some um, micro kale to put in the salads with the uh, butter, lettuce, tender sweet, just pieces of that. Um, and I got, also got some baby kale because I'm gonna be making, uh, if you guys mean follow me, um, I share with you guys a little tip to make like ice cubes of pre-made um, smoothies. So I'm, I'm gonna make mix these up with the celery. So I got, uh, a thing of celery and the kale and then I'm probably gonna be using some orange so I got four oranges here and uh, and I don't know what else I'm gonna make for the smoothie mix but that's uh, the beginning so I got some crumble feta cheese uh, for the salad uh, lemon hummus I have I highly highly recommend you guys this uh, it, hummus itself is really good, but then it has this one that it's a lemon one. Uh, it's so good with the uh, little uh, pita crackers from Simple Meals. Um, and this one is a Mediterranean. I usually have used this uh, sea salt or the um, rosemary um, one, but this one is Mediterranean, so I thought I'll give that a try. Um, with a lemon hummus as a snack. And I also got these cucumber garlic dill dip uh, made with Greek yogurt. It's also a great snack, which is with crackers. Um, and then I got some Black Forest ham from Applegate Naturals. Um, they are uh, really good uh, as the way that they process this because it's um, no antibiotics, you know, animal welfare cert uh, certified. So it's good quality i also got a little thing of hot dogs i thought it was gonna be bigger than this but it's okay because i from time to time i like to uh give these um the kids with the, these are turkey hot dogs they're organic same applegate brand i highly recommend that brand is great and then I got some organic from Whole Foods 365 um, brand. And these are the cheese crackers. These are great for the kids to have a little snack in between meals. Then I have the Nature's Path organic gluten-free buckwheat wildberry waffles um, just to have on hand for an easy breakfast and just, you know, fast uh, type of thing. And we got a, a little tin of um, uh, raspberries, a little thing of strawberries. Um, and then we have the Annie's Organic Cheddar Snack Mix. I was just gonna get plain 
pretzels because the kids have been really enjoying eating pretzels but then uh, i figured that these are probably better and might have less junk and maybe additional nutrition i'm not sure um but the kids really like these so i thought i would just get that uh, the oranges like i mentioned the cucumber a little baggie of the uh tiny cucumbers for the salads so i got this this was honestly a mistake because they are only four and obviously i need way more than four i thought it was like the bigger pack i didn't look closely but in the meantime this this is something that we already use it's a go go squeeze uh fruit and veggies this is the boulder berry uh flavor i also got some organic light balsamic vinaigrette for the salad uh i don't know why you guys but i'm craving salad salads like crazy so i'm gonna be actually having these for lunch um, make up my my own little salad and then some pinto beans um, in a can from Siete. I don't think I have tried Siete's pinto refried beans, but um, I'm gonna give them a try. And I got some uh, mandarin oranges from Whole Foods 365 Market. Um, this for my salad and also for the kids to have as a snack. And lastly, I got these. Um, it was probably like an impulsive buy. Uh, it's an organic vanilla marshmallow cream i think this is good for like fruit dipping and stuff like that so they can use this with um, apples or their strawberries and so this is the wrap for the whole foods haul you guys i hope that you guys get some ideas or maybe new products that you have not seen before this is it for today's grocery haul i hope you guys enjoy be sure to check out the playlist and tiffany's channel at small town six thank you guys for joining me today and i hope you keep joining me for more stay tuned and we'll see you on the next one Bye.